out a video you'll see only on Local 10 News, a man being held at gunpoint during a scary home invasion. The armed robbers beat up the victim and trashed his house. He spoke with Local 10's Andrew Perez, who's live in Pembroke Pines, with the exclusive. Andrew. Yeah, we also spoke with his girlfriend as well, who's seen in that video. We do want to warn you that some of the details, some of the images in this, images in all of this are extremely disturbing. These men, they rushed in armed without second thought. There's a gun to her back. A second man knocks the camera down. About a second goes by. The men start yelling their demands. Trying to stay calm, keep them calm, so they went and kill me and him. The victim in that video returning to the home. It's a mess. There's blood and broken glass everywhere. I don't want to feel how I'm feeling now. Like I'm, I'm scared. Like I'm, I feel for my life right now. We're not identifying her for safety, but she wants these guys caught. She said she was outside her unit at Morella Apartments in Pembroke Pines. She was talking on the phone, and when she walked back in, she was followed. Her boyfriend was inside the unit. The gunman pistol whipping him and hitting her, making demands. As they got me in the door, I knocked on the door next door trying to play it off. He threw me against the wall of my head, hit the picture, and that's when I kind of like leaned over. The young man say, I'm not leaving if I don't get no money in that laptop. I will kill both of y'all in here if I don't get the money in the laptop. I'm like, babe, just give them whatever they yeah. want. She was caught up in the middle of this, she says. Neighbors telling Local 10, though, they've been concerned about security, namely a gate that's left open and no eyes around the property. Pembroke Pines police are now searching for those gunmen. The victim just thankful she's alive. Her boyfriend is recovering. I don't want people to feel like I had something to do with this when I didn't. It's like when I walk in, it's like I see everything happening over and over, like my heart just dropped. She truly is absolutely terrified, as anybody would be after experiencing something like this. We're working on getting a statement right now from Morella Apartments about security. In the meantime, Pembroke Pines Police actively working this case, looking into all the circumstances. If you have any information whatsoever, call Pembroke Pines Police right away. That's the latest here in Pembroke Pines. I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.